And we turn to Delaware County, where officials in one school district may need to take drastic measures to address a staffing shortage. It's possible that kids in Upper Darby may be learning at a local community college or even at home. Let's bring in NBC 10's Matt DeLucia. He is live in Upper Darby this morning. Uh, Matt, how many positions are we talking about that the district needs to fill? Right now, it's about uh, 70, Aaron, and I'll tell you that the Upper Darby School District, they're warning families that it, they may have to cancel classes or go to virtual learning if they can't find enough subs. And so among those 70 positions that they are looking for right now, they include bus drivers, lunch aides, and substitute teachers. The district says one option would be to have students take classes at a local community college instead. Now, the trouble has been finding enough applicants for these open jobs. Over the summer, the Pennsylvania governor's office announced a plan to recruit and retain educators in the state. A big priority, considering about 10 years ago, around 20,000 new teachers entered the workforce. Compared to last year, only 6,000. And the state says it is also seeing an acceleration in the number of educators who are leaving the profession. A double whammy there. Uh, and there are a number of issues, including the way schools get funding. But for now, the Upper Darby School District says they need these educators. Educators, and if they cannot find them, uh, then they may have to take that option of going to remote learning or perhaps even canceling classes. Now I'm live in Upper Darby, Matt Delusha, NBC 10 News.